guys so much for healthy hair care routine <laughs> if you're doing this you cannot be lazy and i have been lazy i haven't moisturized this hair in a whole week it is dry really really dry and uh, i finally got some time to do it so what i will be using is um I have this uh, mixture of water and glycerin. So this is 80% water, 20% glycerin. Pure, pure glycerin. I'm struggling with that name. <laughs> Village girl, I tell you. And then I'm using avocado oil. Yeah. And then I will use this uh, leave-in conditioner to just to touch, to seal in the moisture at the ends. So, do I have a formula for this? No, I do not. Let me at least section it. This is a mist spray. So, I will... I don't want it to be like wet. And by the way, let me make this note. This is the first time I'm mixing water and glycerin. I saw this tip from a lady on Facebook. Can't remember her name. I'll look for her and then leave her in her name in the description box. So after that, I'll go in with some oil. Just a tiny bit. Focusing on the tips. The ends, I mean, and then literally the tiniest bit because I don't want to have too much build up. But I have to say, I can feel the difference in texture, so maybe this uh, mixture will be working for me. So that's done. Let's see whether we notice the difference. Yeah, actually you can. I don't know if you can. So let me go in with two. Oh. I just want it to be moisturized. I don't want it to be wet. I don't, know. I don't know if you can tell the difference. Like, uh, I want it to be soft. I don't want it to be like dripping water. Going with the oil. Focus on the ends. Even conditioner, focus on the ends, and then go in. So three done. I don't know how many more to go. Let's do this as well. Now, in case you don't know, it is really important to moisturize your hair every once in a while because um, it prevents breakage and uh, it makes hair manageable Lo in the long run like I expect my hair to be a little bit softer when if it won't change in the texture completely I expect it to be a, a little bit softer so um yeah because what happens is dry hair breaks very easily and when i say when i talk about moisture i mean water like being the main ingredients so you, you can't oil your hair and say you've moisturized what you do is get some water in and then 
some oil. And then some cream if you want to. So this one here at the back. That part is done. As far as how it feels goes, yeah, you can even see, you can even tell. Want to give more attention to the edges as I told you guys in the last video because because um, of the damage, not the edges, the hairline. Rather. So I'll be giving them some love. The living conditioner is meant to seal because avocado oil is like um it gets absorbed by the hair so it doesn't sit on the hair strand so it's not like the best sealant but of course it's the best when it comes to helping with moisturizing I have to be honest, that hair does feel different. You can even notice like um, the difference between now and when we started. Right? You can notice there's a shine, you can notice there's a change in texture. Like it's a, um, a bit soft. Not a bit, it's quite soft. <sighs> we just need to be consistent and will get to healthy hair eventually, eventually. So, of course, after moisturizing, we're still going to put it back in the bun. I love this, whatever, it's uh, okay, because of the oil, the grip is not nice. It's not the best, but I love how the, the mists thingy, because that hair is moisturized, but it's not like dripping wet. The water is not flowing all over my face as compared to a spritz bottle so i would recommend a mist spray so what i'm now going to do is cover that hair That's it guys, I'm going to leave that in for a few minutes, like uh, 20 minutes or so, and then I'm, I'll remove it and uh, redo this process next week, I hope. I want to at least be doing it at least once a week. We'll see. I'm not putting so much pressure on myself, we'll see how it goes. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you are doing this with me if you have decided to embark on, on your healthy hair care journey. I hope you're doing this with me. Let's keep doing this together. And then maybe sometime next year, same time next year, we'll be back with results. Like, oh, look at my long hair. Well, not length mostly, but help get my healthy hair. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. And uh, give us some love. Thank you. Bye-bye.